Okay, welcome to our first proper episode of uh, Roma Rectum, Rome Total War with the Roma Rectum mod. We are playing Macedonia. Um, we are going to now start out and see what happens. Um, first things first, I will try to make these episodes um, 30 minutes long. Uh, if I'm inside a battle when my timer beeps, uh, I won't just quit the battle or um, end the recording there. I will continue the battle until it's concluded uh, and then uh, quit the episode after that. Um, so yeah, that's how it's going to be. So the um, length of these episodes may vary a bit. Um, yeah. Uh, we are going to start with the first things, and that is, yeah, the script, I almost forgot. Um, to play this mod you need to activate the uh, mod's special script every time you load, or, yeah, every time you load a game. So you do that just by clicking the uh, lady here, there. The script is now uh, active and running. And yeah, let's start with the first things, checking uh, who we are at war with and uh, who we are at peace with. <coughs> Rome is our enemy, and most worrying, the Greek city-states, uh, Pergamon, I think Pergamon is on the other side of the water here, so uh, I'm not really worried about them. But the Greek city-states, we will be facing those uh, very soon. And yeah, rebels and free people, everyone's at war with them. But yeah, the Greek city-states, they are our enemy. Um, they are the brown guys here. They have Athens and Thebes, um, as we can see now. That doesn't look too scary, but really, um, they have uh, cities all over the Mediterranean. Syracuse here, Massilia here, and... Uh, other stuff all around the Mediterranean so they are really a dangerous faction for us um, so we are going to build an army uh, at Pharsalus and um, uh, try to um, try to hinder their march into our territory there's not much we can do for Corinthos right now I think um, <coughs> is defended by a few troops um, but there's not much we can do to to help it out right now so we are going to build an army here and try to take Thebes that's the only thing only thing we can do for Corinthos which is quite isolated there um, we do have a navy we have ships two ships out here um, so we are going to sail to yes, Athens, oh, space to get them moving, uh, yeah, and blockade, blockade their port. I don't know what kind of a navy they have, they might be mm, coming for us, but uh, we'll just try that. Um, yeah, now let's uh, see if we can get together some troops. Uh, actually, I'd like to send out mm, yeah, we have one spy and one diplomat so we are going to use these guys uh, the spy is actually going west because the Romans have a city out here, I know that, and the Greek city-states also have one here, so we're going to go check what's happening there by sending a spy, because they will be coming in this way and uh, threatening Edessa there, so uh, yeah, that's the Roman city. Um, and they should be, oh yeah, Apollonia, there it is. So I'm going to leave my spy somewhere around here to keep an eye on this path here. Um, 
I'm not going to do anything for Edessa at this moment. Oh god. They don't even have a governor, do they? Um, let's start moving their troops about a bit. We'll take our best soldiers with us. I think we can take everything from here. And try to form an army just north of Farsalus there. Actually, I'd like to take my king with me. He's really good. He's the best general I have. Um, oh, we have ships in there too, do we? No, I can't recruit them. Okay, 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 okay. So yeah, I'll take my, my best troops. My lord. Um, my lord. <coughs> Aha, this is a mm, glitch with the mod. Uh, let's see if we can remove it. Nope. It's a glitch with the mod that we get yes, the... Uh, okay, there's the picture. That we get the, just the white screen. Now it's gone, it should be. Yeah, it's gone now. You just need to select another unit uh, in another area and it's okay then. But it's, it's a weird glitch. Let's now take yes, our best troops. Yes, I think we'll take them up yes, until here. Stratigos. Oh, archers, yes, I'd, like, I'd like to have some of those. And the king yes, himself. Stratigos. These are really good troops, I think. And just make an army here. That's a pretty much a full army. Um, so really, I'm just go. I'm not going to fall into his territory. I'm. I'm not yet. Uh, I'd like to have another full army with me, actually, for a proper offensive. One to do the siege and one to uh, operate around it. Yeah, uh, let's continue moving troops yes, from here into the capital. I don't want to leave it undefended. I don't want to leave this area, this whole area undefended. Troops from Pelican march in any direction here, so... Uh, but this city is a bit isolated, so I'll leave these troops here. It has no governor, this city, that's a pity. Uh, because... Uh, this um, is a Greek city-state area too, I think. I'm not sure. I could actually send my diplomat up there yes, my lord. just to have a check. It's a long way, yes, but off lord. he goes. At once. Uh, I can't... Yes, master. At once. Uh, it has a b m kind of brown brown border so I think it's a Greek city-state I think this is a neutral area but I don't have the forces to actually go and occupy it right now so we have to wait shark is there will be okay it's isolated on an island uh, so I think it will be okay I'm really hoping though that they attack Corinthos the first thing they do because then I'll march on Thebes what else? We need to do the taxes. That's always fun, isn't it? Doing the taxes. Um, ah, no governor. I don't like that. I don't like no governor for my capital. So I'm actually going to take the governor. How are you, sir? Pretty bad. Pretty bad. Bad. Um, pretty bad. Your not uh, your management. Well, I'm just going to take this man here yes, and move him to the capital, just to have a governor there. Um, Pharsalus is going to be a battleground. I hope so. Uh, so yeah, this is what I ha have right now to work with. Um, I have one army, one very good army though, led by the king himself. Oh, I'm missing a few here. I should... I, I do want this army to be full. Yeah, these are phalanx, so they are 
really defensive but really great in the field. This is this is crap. I'm going to though move all these troops out to the king. Um, they couldn't quite reach his, reach him because they came all the way from over here, I think. But I'm going to recruit more troops as well. Um, first, I do need to do the boring stuff, taxes, and uh, I would like some roads out at Philippi because it doesn't seem to have roads. Um, really, the buildings in this game. I'm a bit confused. I know that the well is supposed to be good. And yeah, public health bonus plus 20. Mm, tax income bonus minus 30. So yeah, they're, they're good. Things are also... So yeah, this mod has added a lot of new stuff that you can build. But I'm... At this point I'm quite confused by some of it. 10,000 for a mine. Um, trade expeditions. Where are the roads? Oh, there they are. Um, so that's something I'm going to start with. At least here. And Far Celeste, do you have roads? I can't see any roads there actually. Tin Road, but I can't see it on the map. It's weird. Blacksmith. There's the well. But I'd really like to recruit some troops now uh, from Pella or in Pella uh, because this city is now really undefended. So we are going to queue up some good troops or good or cheap good and or cheap. Now look at that again. <coughs> I don't like it. But that's how you fix it. Or fix, work around it. Yeah, now it's okay. Um, these are really defensive. Agrianian infantry. LA 16, those are quite good but expensive as hell. These are really expensive body and phalangites. Really expensive, also really good. Let's just go for with uh, the cheapest stuff we can find. Uh, they aren't bad in any way though. Just queue a couple of them basic troops to keep our um, cities safe. I'd like some cavalry that uh, is good at melee and charging because that's what you use them for. Attack 15, 42, 6, 94. That's pretty cheap actually. Let's queue a whole lot of them. I like cavalry, really do. Um, yeah, that's it. I think that's it for this turn. Um, we have moved all our agents, we have moved our fleet, we have uh, not done the taxes. No, that's what we are going to do. So let's start doing the taxes. We start at Pella. Um, very high taxation. Forceless. Very high taxation. As long as the face is green, I'm happy. Or I don't care about yellow, but uh, green. Preferably. Yellow, I think we can do it. Everything for the money here now, because we need to get this cash flow going here. Um, I hope they won't take Corinthos anytime soon. Um, yeah, our cities can hold this. They can do this. Obviously. This one is far out. Our far away colony here. 
Uh, it is. Uh, that's better. Okay, we are back where we started. So those are our cities, and we have now done the uh, tax update there. So yeah, I'm going to continue now building that army and uh, send more troops from Pella as I get them. Um, build a really strong and good army there for defending Pharsalus, because there will be a battle there. I'm hoping that, or that they attack Corinthals. They will be coming from here. They will. So, yeah, let's end the turn, see what happens. Oh, what was that? What are you doing? Oh, trade rights with Sparta. I'm, of course, going to accept. Mm. I would like to have an alliance with them. Keep them off my back there, but... Didn't see it there. Here we are, now we're... Uh, around. Mm. The Greek city-states haven't... Uh, have they left... Uh, what are they doing? They are moving their armies, they are now standing, all of them are standing around Athens. It's weird. Let's check our economy. We are doing gold now. Yeah, starting treasury. Uh, profits. Yeah, good. Very good income. So we're going to continue building those armies there. Uh, Sparta and Greek city-states cease fire. That means Sparta might actually be coming for us too. Okay, we have recruited these troops now. That's good news. National announcements, um, trade increases and retinues. Philip V got, got an armorer, plus one morale for all troops on the battlefield. Excellent. Good, good, good. Our king is really good. Of course he is. It's Philip. Philip the fifth himself. Almost full now. So if they don't move on me, I'm going to build two big units around Pharsalus and then I'm going to march in towards Thebes. That's the plan now. So, oh god, these are Whatever happened here? These are quite good. I want these in the main army My here Lord. now. <coughs> so yes, I'm going to... I'm going to just start Living making the, the second army, army here. Onward. But I want Waiting these, these guys, yes, in my main oh. army. Uh, these also have the chevrons and stuff. Good lord, these yes, are good Strati troops. Horse, I'm going to deploy everything like this in My the main lord, army. Dead, the army. I would dead, like to get more sir. family members so I could send them out to this, so I could give the second army here a general too. Uh, what should we do? We should build stuff to increase our uh, increase our economy. Uh, let's check now. Tax income bonus 40. Happiness bonus minus 40. We can do that. Um, we're going to build that tax thing. Mm. Then we need something to counter that with happiness. Mm. River port. Ooh. That's good. That's good for income. Product really expensive. Happiness bonus 15%. But it's really expensive, it's 11,000. Mm, happiness bonus minus 40%. Okay, this could counter that quite effectively. The Temple of Ares. Uh, I'm going to build that. I do like to keep the happiness up though. Mm. 
I'd like to recruit some troops to two, a lot of them, so I want at least 10,000 when I start recruiting troops. Mm, I'm going with the river port as well. I'm building these three things now in my capital. Uh, I'm not going to concentrate on the other ones before those are uh, finished. Uh, I think that's the way to go here. Um, now we have 10,000 to recruit troops for. Uh, those troops from Pella were really good. Uh, so re let's continue recruiting here. And yeah. <coughs> oh, that crap again. But I'm not going to care. Oops, uh, missile attacks and a char. Oh, yeah, they are quite good. Agrianian infantry. I'd want, I want one, one of those. Those are so expensive that I won't invest in them. But I want some basic archers. Missile attack 6. Missile attack 9. Greek archers, that's what I want and I want, mo I want lots of them. And some of that great cavalry too. Which ones did I consider being better here? Taxis, hope light. Um, yeah, these are better. Why are they cheaper? They're better. I'm going to take these guys. Okay, that's the full queue for that city. I'm going to recruit my troops there. I think I have some kind of barracks or something that gives me promotions for them. So I'm going to, every turn, just queue up a lot of troops in there and just uh, start sending them around. I think we are going to leave our spy there. But our diplomat is going to... Yes, my lord. Oh yeah, there we are. I need to attack that. Yes, my lord. Let's go see the barbarians, Once. shall we? Mm. Yes, my lord. Oh, who are these? I shall speak with them at once. I would like to offer you trade rights and an alliance. Okay. <coughs> go away and live. Let's just propose trade rights. <laughs> Those were quite stubborn. Okay. Well, yes, master. Uh, your yes, way. Master. We are going, yes, going, master. going away then. Um, we need to attack that. There's no governor or any general out there to uh, to do that. But yeah. Mm. Let's just keep an eye on this, what's happening here. Yes, Lots of trade there, I would like to take Moving. this city too. Why can't I see what's in there? Moving. Nothing? Is there nothing in there? There are no troops in here. Just one single family member. How far can my king move? Not very far. Um, I would have to build a second army up there. But I really want the war in the south to have a sort of conclusion. But that's really an open city right now. I have to think about that. I think he's moved his troops south to come this way. Might be it. That is also <coughs> also an empty city. I can't see any armies around. Uh, 
I'm wondering if he's fighting the Romans or something. Yeah, well, I can't move anymore now, but that's an open city, really. Okay, I think we've done our stuff here. No red faces anywhere, only green ones and one yellow. So, yeah, let's go for the next turn now. See what happens here. <coughs> yeah, the siege of the siege of Thebes has begun. And so he's actually attacking us now. Mm. Hang on, who's that? Basileus, neutral. It's a neutral fact. Oh, that's not our city. Um, I'm looking at the wrong thing. This map can sometimes be a r pretty confusing. He's now laying siege to uh, Corinthos, as expected. But he has also arrived here with an army. We're going to send the king for that. Um, first, we're going to send that second My army in here. And now My we're Lord. sending the king. Yeah, this will be a good battle. We are sli slightly outnumbering him. We are not getting any reinforcements though. That's a pity, but we are going to fight this now. The first battle. We have three minutes left of this Let's Play episode, so I'm going to fit. And then I have to end the episode after that, but first we are going to do this. Today! It's a good day yeah. to die! Yeah, today is a good day to die. Those speeches are quite cool, but uh, I'm not going to listen to them. Uh, actually, we haven't seen the uh, battle before, have we? So, just look at it. It's smashing. It's just beautiful. It's like a painting. Battle painting. We're going to go up on that hill. Um, I think we have good terrain here. So, what we are going to do is group our cavalry into one sort of brigade or what, whatever we, we like to call it. Division? It's a cavalry division. And uh, try to outflank him with it. Um, phalanx. They need a bit of a special treatment. Uh, this is it. this is how you use phalanx, or how they used phalanx. I don't know how to do it in this. I'm not really very experienced with these this game. So uh, really, if I do any errors or anything, just just tell me in the comments. Uh, Heavy infantry archers. We are going to leave our archers just behind the phalanx. Light infantry, light infantry, light infantry. We are going to keep the heavy in uh, the front. Heavy. And our light infantry. Really, we could use them as skirmishes for good measure, but I'm not going to put anything in front of the phalanx now, am I? So I'm going to just leave them as reserve to fill any gaps that may appear. Um, yeah, you shouldn't be in skirmish mode. The general right behind and we have some more cavalry there. I'm going to actually leave that with the general. So, ah, come on, get in line there. So what we need now to do is to get up on that hill there and uh, take it. Then we wait for the enemy. So, yeah, this is our order of battle. Look at it. Just, just look at it. It's beautiful and it's going to get even more beautiful as we get into battle. Um, what we want to do with our phalanx is to, uh, well, uh, smash smash them right into the enemy and uh, 
really. Oh, there goes my timer, but we're going to do this battle first. Uh, smash them right into the front of the enemy. And, uh, I'm good. Actually, we need to keep their flanks secured because we don't want anyone to get behind them or in their side. So, yeah. Um, let's start here and see where we end up with this uh, battle. Uh, let's now go. We must go quickly. And I don't want them to run. Certainly not. Uh, I'm going to group these with control 1 so I can easily uh, control them. What's he doing? Yeah, he's forming up. He doesn't have any phalanx, a few of them. It would be really nice to smash my phalanx right into him like this. That would be disaster for him. So we're going to try and take the mountain, which... It really looks like we're going to have an easy time doing. So yeah, and we're going to drive these ones from around the mountain up here in his back. That's the plan here. Some of those phalanx are getting way ahead of the other ones. I think he has spotted my cavalry actually. Yeah, look at it. This is a day of destiny for Macedonia. We are going forward into battle with the rest of the Greek nations. What is he doing? Is he just running them around, is he? That's weird. Some weird behavior there from the. Oh, he's setting up a front though. I wonder what he says when my cavalry smashes right into his side. I wonder what he thinks about that. Um, sometimes I don't play this on uh, normal speed. Uh, I speed it up just during the movements, but... Uh, they're firing already, are they? Let's see if it does some damage. Uh, perhaps a bit. I don't know. Uh, I don't think we will have any problems defeating that. I will actually just order my army straight into him. Um, and the fighting will commence. Our phalanx will just rip through him, I think. Uh, he has chosen a really bad ground there. Like this. I hope to engage his entire line, then go in with my cavalry from the back there. I can see his entire army. I don't think anything is hidden now. So, boys, now we go to battle. Look at this. The Greek phalanx. Oh, yes. It's like a bloody painting. Good lord, yeah. Nice. It's a ni just a nice view. Oh my! Who's that? It's actually trying to outflank me here. It won't happen. I'm prepared. I'm moving this cavalry unit up here to be able to strike him. And uh, now I think the time has come for my cavalry to go perhaps down there. And smash right into his side right here. Light infantry. Yeah, we are going to go. Uh, our cavalry is going to do some immense damage over here. Let's order the cavalry attack. Perfect. 
perfect. Look at that. And our phalanx are going in. Told you so. Rip right through them. Let's just keep our cavalry working here. Macedon heavy. Oh, we have already broken through there. Jeez. Okay, these guys are now chasing some stragglers there. <coughs> oh, what happened here? I would like to have my cavalry available on this front now. Oh, that would be excellent to attack in the rear. That's spearmen, so we don't want to attack that. Look at the fighting going on now. We're doing well, as long as we can keep our cavalry working here. What is my cavalry brigade or other division doing? Why is it messing around with that uh, simple There's a spearman, I do not really want to attack spearmen. So I'm just going to set up my cavalry. Um, yeah, we have we're winning a pretty good victory here, I think. That's the general's unit there, his spearman unit. Oh, he's coming in for the attack, is he? But uh, that won't help him because we are around his flank here. Yeah, we're doing short work. Um, actually, that cavalry brigade back there could come here and just set up here and take out survivors. I do not want to attack spearmen. Run, please. I do not want to attack spearmen at all. Oh, that's some sort of an archer unit. We attack that. Good work, boys. Good work. The king himself has now engaged in combat. I don't like that. I want him out of it. ASAP. That's not good. And these three units, please block here. Ah, uh, yeah, it's going well. Take that out. We have completely broken through there. No, General, please don't. That's our king. He should actually be on guard mode. He shouldn't move at all. He's, it's just him left. We don't want him to die. Why aren't they breaking? The battle is over. Oh, those are breaking. I'm then going to order cavalry to, to, to just go look for them. Those are breaking too. We're going to order these troops here to take care of the rest of those. Look at this smoke from the battle there. Yeah, look at the fighting. Nice. This should actually pretty much be it. Um, they are all routed now, yeah. So we are going to let them run. It was a near thing that uh, my king here actually got himself killed. Uh, that wouldn't have been great at all. It's just him left of his entire bodyguard unit. Look at the remains of the battle. The there enemy we are. general is slain, and now his men fear us. It is time to press the attack. Finally. That's a good result. This is the mopping up now. So yeah. The gods be praised. Oh. 
that was our first battle, it uh, was very good. Uh, I will actually end the recording here and hope to see you next time for the next episode of this. So yeah, thanks for watching and cheers!